like Zion sending you? Freestyle. 
freestyle WQ3 DML Division 4A, I am Zion Firestar and this is the previously unheard shoutcast coverage of the Zion game. First matchup for us this season was against QQ, they're uh, local rivals of ours and we play them quite a lot in practice but they've always beaten us. So the, we came into this game thinking maybe, maybe we can take a win from it. We went out there and we gave it our hardest try and we managed to take CPM4 off them and uh, that gave us the hope for DM14. We knew it was going to be tight, we haven't practiced much on this map, and it was. They uh, came at us really hard after losing CPM4 to us, and we only managed to score a, wi a win in the final few seconds with a few frags. Next matchup was against Onig. So these two games were going to be really, really tight. Onig are also a local team that we play against regularly, and uh, we were hoping we could repeat our QQ performance against them. First map, we were winning by 20 frags, and, uh, but they came back against us and uh, took it from us and breaking down our strategy excellently. Second map was on OSPDM5 and they really did well. Um, we were 20 frags ahead, there were two minutes left and they managed to beat us by four frags. That really demoralized Zion. Next matchup was against MVR. We knew this side with Division 3 material so we didn't hold out much hope but we gave it our best try. On OSPDM6 they happily thrashed us. But on Pro DM6 we came back at them in the second half of the match but it wasn't enough, and it was far too late, and we lost it. But that was it. Uh, next game up is going to be against OMG. And uh, we knew nothing about this side, but we uh, hoped we could put up some good performances like we had against Onig and QQ, and repeat that sort of performance. It wasn't to be. We fielded a weaker side, and OMG hammered us on both maps. We had great team play, though, but uh, OMG was just the better side 1v1. The next game up for us was against the S9R. Now S9R are an awesome team. Uh, we knew very little about them, but we did know that they were in the same bracket as MVR. And uh, we weren't looking forward to it after a massive thrashing by MVR in the early stages of the season. Up came the S9R game, and uh, we uh, played the Pro DM6. It's an awesome map. We hate it, but uh, we did our best on it, and they thrashed us. Then came DM7. Now we thought we were going to get the same thrashing, but in the first seven minutes of the game we managed to hold our own. Our strategy outplayed them, but it didn't last long and they managed to thrash us back into submission and took both mats. Now the next game up that was really important was the last one of the season. It was a postponed match against Smack. Now we, we were having some problems with getting players for our games at the end of the season due to connection problems. And here we went. 3 versus 4 against Smack. The odds were against us, but we tried our absolute best. We lost the first map by 20 frags, and I was playing on ISDM, which really didn't help the team, as it left Shinta and Zelda as the only two real players in the match against these four awesome Smack players. We did our best, though, and uh, finally lost the final map by 6 frags. So that was our season over. We were relegated in the end but we only lost it by 10 frags over two maps, so we took a person to sixth place. Well done, S9R.
Zion's where the party would be.